Hello guys and welcome back to another video. For today's video, I'm actually going to be doing a nail vlog, so I'm going to bring you guys along with me to get my nails done. I've done one other one of these videos in the past and you guys really loved it, which was for my cherry nails actually. But guys, look how my cherry nails look right now. I'm missing a nail, so you guys know I definitely need to get this pop in. So, what I'm going to do is... I think I'm going to grab some Starbucks first because I was supposed to go somewhere with my dad right now, but we didn't end up going. So I got out of bed. I didn't really get ready. So this is raw me right now, but I'm going to get some Starbucks because I am a little bit early. My appointment is at 1030. So I think I have time to get some Starbucks. So I'm going to get, I don't know, maybe like a green tea frap or a nice coffee or something to wake me up because I haven't had coffee this morning and I have coffee like every single day. I also don't want to talk about my week much, but it's been a mess. <laughs> Can you guys relate? Like, I feel like this week has not been the best for me. Um, there's just been a lot of things going on, and I even have a cold sore on my lip right now. It's healing because I've been putting this, like, ointment on, but it has not been a good week, guys. And I don't know what to tell you. And I have class tomorrow, and I'm just, like, stressed. So let me stop going off on a tangent and I'll go ahead and see you guys when I get to the nail place. Okay, so I just got my Starbucks. Um, if you guys are wondering what it is that I get, I just started getting um, an iced vanilla latte. And this is what my sister does because she likes really like sugary drinks. And I honestly, I like more creamer than coffee to be honest. So what she does is they put I believe six pumps of vanilla so I just end up asking for seven which is what I've heard her ask for and when she gets it like that it's so like good um, I feel like I've gotten like really bitter coffee sometimes and I'm not like with that so um, I really like the sugary sort of deal so that's what I got I got an iced vanilla latte with seven pumps of vanilla so it comes out pretty good actually it's not that sweet now that I think about it. But it's still good. So I'm going to go get my nails done. I'm probably going to be there for a couple of hours because I'm getting a soak off. Oh, I didn't mention. Um, so I was going to go in for a fill on Tuesday. But we just ended up rescheduling um, twice because she had some things come up. And I understand when things come up. So I was like, that's totally fine. So it's not going to be a fill anymore. It's going to be a soak off. So I'm going to take off these nails and just start with a brand new full set, which I think would be better in the long run, just because I feel like these nails are going to pop off soon. And I'd rather just start fresh with a new set. So that's what I'm going to get. Now I didn't mention really anything about what it is that I want to get done this time, but this time I'm going to get done I really hope this is not as shaky as I think it is, but this time I'm going to get done. Nothing super dramatic like the little cherries that I got last time are super all over the top, but I wanted to get something more red ombre. I think I gave her like a picture, so I'm going to include it here once again. I feel like I did that last time and it was really nice to just show you guys what it is that I wanted. So I just want a red ombre. I just really like red, if you guys have not noticed by now. So that's what I'm going for and... Yeah, that's it. I should be there on time, so. We're here with the one and only Vivian. Hey, <laughs> hey. So, what are we gonna do today? We're going to do a try ombre with red, orange, and pink, and a glow stitch. So, and we're gonna do basically the tips are gonna be these colors for ombre, and then this is gonna be her ombre from her base to uh, the free edge. I don't know, it's gonna make shit pop off, you know? Yeah, so my nails are all off. Hee <laughs> hee. Did a soak off real quick. Um, all her nails were good. Some of them did pop off. This one was off already. I don't know where it went. Got lost in the OC fair, but it's okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is what a proper soak off should look like. So we're here shaping the nails. You see how her hands are relaxed? That's how your hand should be before you get smacked with this. She's not playing. I'm not playing. I just be like, relax your hand. <laughs> your lashes look great. Oh, girl, they need a fill. Do they? Yeah, they do. <laughs> they but do. I sleep on this side, so most of the ones on this one is all fucked up. 
You're still looking good. Thank you. <laughs> Said one two, <laughs> one two. <laughs> it's I like doing that because it's like you get the right amount of evenness on each side. Mm. Wow, look at that! Wow. Okay. I can walk out right now. Okay, just then like bye. this. <laughs> so sis, you're saving me a lot of time here. Wow, there's a lot of colors, sis. Pigment, pigment, bitch. Do you want to add yellow or no? <gasps> I just want to know why I look like such a mess today. I look like a mess. Okay, anyway, so I just came back from getting my nails done and I want to show y'all because they came out so good. She actually added pink into the mix, so I just wanted a red. But what I like to do is give her some sort of creative freedom to tell me if she wants to try out something new, I'm always down, which is nice. She came out with the bombest nails. They're so cute. Let me show you guys. It's like this beautiful ombre. And then you have the little crystals there so cute i like how she made it a different color so the crystals are green this is how they look in the light they look so stunning So I think now I'm just going to go ahead and work on some sticker orders. But aside from that, today is a pretty chill day. This is my first Friday not working. I don't know. I have to study a ton too. So I guess I can show you guys that um, because I have a test tomorrow. I believe tomorrow is my last day for my first um, interpretation course. So that should be exciting and stressful. So um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go work on some orders and... We are back. I think just so this nail vlog is not too short, I want to just bring you guys along with me through my day, what it is that I'm going to do today. Okay, I'm probably going to look a bum this whole video because, I don't know, when I have things to do, I do not look good. I look like poop and like I have this um, really dry cold sore that I want to get away from me already. So I'm trying to put the ointment as much as I can. And I don't know, I just look like a mess. I feel like a mess, but that's life sometimes let's just keep it real so what i'm doing right now i finished up some orders and i also ate and i realized that i didn't film any of that so for food i ate arroz chaufa which is just basically fried rice peruvian fried rice and um now i'm gonna go ahead and study because i have a test tomorrow which this class is called simultaneous techniques and criminal technology i need to do both last week's lab as well as this week's lab which is going to be for tomorrow because last week obviously i didn't go to class because i was in austin which was super super fun to do but i feel like i'm a little behind now but I know I could do this. I'm just like really stressed. I don't know if you guys can see it in my face and my voice, just everything. I'm stressed. Maybe this is the worst day to film one of these videos, but I do want to go ahead and show you guys. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and make some flashcards, which 
I bought some from Daiso yesterday. I think these are the best flashcards if you're using them for like, let's say, um, single terms. I got these flashcards from Daiso and they already sort of come pre-packaged. I feel like I had other ones um, that only had two per pack, but I think these are so much nicer because they're kind of slimmer. So I got the pack with three, as well as I got the other pack, which comes with four. So I think this is perfect to put on all of my terminology. This was only $1.50 per pack. If you guys know Daiso, um, it is just basically like the Japanese $1.50 store, which I love. So that is where I get my flashcards. I also got went ahead and picked up this pen from Daiso, which is the um, Friction, the Pilot Friction pen. And it is erasable. I thought it would be nice to try it out. This was an... 0.5 so super excited and then i do have um my terminology for last week to work with for last week so we already had part one the week prior so this is part two and this is criminal offenses part two so that is what i am working with i also have my little notebook here from erin condren i don't think i mentioned this last week because i don't um two weeks ago i mean because I didn't upload a weekly vlog that day, but I do want to show you guys. I have the Erin Condren um, little bag. This is in the faux leather. I don't think it's real leather, is it? I'm scared. Um, but I picked that up and mine seemed to be pretty nice. The only thing that I'm not like too happy about would be the metal kind of tarnishing on the sides, which I don't think you can see it right now. So I don't know if you guys can tell right there. That's the only thing that I'm not happy with, but the rest of the bag came pretty nice there's no um scratches not really bended anywhere it's just right now that it's there but i really like this bag and it fits all of my school things um really nicely so if you guys would like to see maybe like a school bag video um what it is that i keep in there for school for my classes just go ahead and let me know i can always make a video of that but yes yeah, so i'm gonna make my flashcards for that um, go over that lab and then focus on what I have to do for tomorrow because tomorrow it's going to be a whole exam situation um, And I'm stressed. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that I'm going to target with my grandma because my grandparents are going are going back to Peru Which I'm kind of sad about and I think that's just something that has added to like the stress that I have this week um, My grandparents are going back to Peru and I'm really sad about it. So yeah probably going to go to Target to buy um, some candies for my family in Peru and my grandma has to pick up a couple like last minute things and that's going to be it.